Last hour, we showed you Donald Trump meeting with members of the ICE union, immigration control officers. We have news on this. What was said at this meeting? It's interesting. This was picked up by cameras as he was meeting with the leaders of the union of the Immigration and Customs Enforcement officials who, for the very first time, are uh, uh, endorsing a presidential candidate, i.e. Donald Trump. Uh, what you pick up on the conversation is uh, Art Del Cueto. He's the national uh, the VP and the president of the uh, chapter in Tucson, basically telling Donald Trump that he's asking him, so where are they, why are these undocumented uh, immigrants with criminal records, why are they being kicked out, and why is there this rush to get these uh, illegal immigrants citizenship? And he says, the, uh, the uh, ICE official says, simply so they can vote. That's the, what the ICE officials yes, said. Yes, so they can get oh, onto the ballot to vote. And so Trump repeats that and says, why? So he said, they, could, they can vote. So then Trump says, well, so they can come into the country so they can vote. How can something like this happen? It's a disgrace. And the guy says, it's happening. It is happening now. <laughs> Indiana, more than half of its counties in Indiana, the state police is investigating voter fraud. You don't need an ID to do mail-in voting. So, you know, this is a Clinton, Bill Clinton playbook. They wanted to get uh, immigrants basically made citizens to vote. Matt Schlapp, still with us. I think you heard all of this. Yeah. This yes. surely puts this immigration and, I, I guess, illegal voting, yeah. I guess this puts this right in the forefront of the debate on Sunday night, doesn't it? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, what is more sacred than making sure that you have the right to vote? Uh, and exercise that right. And it's just repugnant to Americans mm. to think that people could vote uh, when, when it's not legal. And uh, this is all but, the problem with the basic... Sec. You know, one, one of the things that really annoys so many people is that if you say, I think you should have to produce ID before That's you right. vote, then you are called a bigot. That's right. I, for one, don't like it, and I don't think anybody else does. And now we have this from the ICE people. I think this puts it right up front in the debate. Last word to you. Yeah, absolutely. Everything that you do of importance in our society, you have to produce an ID and records. Absolutely everything. Why is voting somehow unique? It is wrong to uh, have even the risk of somebody voting who shouldn't vote or vote twice or any kind of shenanigans. And, boy, this is going to be a close election, Stuart. Every vote's going to matter. And I think there should be no question about the fact that it is uh, legal and done appropriately. Uh, Matt Schlapp, thank you very much for joining us, sir. Much appreciated on a Thanks, day Stuart. like this.